Okay, this is a short video to talk about Carl Fisher grease and how to apply it. But, um, well, first, this is uh, Carl Fisher grease comes in a container. Uh, it can be 5 grams or 50 grams, I've seen it. Um, it looks like a little cream in there, and it doesn't look like much. And um, there's actually enough in there to use for quite a long time. Sometimes I see a lot of overuse with Carl Fisher grease. But uh, the reason we use it, uh, I thought it would be appropriate to show you uh, some different vessels. This is a vessel that has screw-on caps, and typically you would have a seal under here and you would seal your Carl Fisher vessel with a, with a cap. Um, we use Carl Fisher grease when we're working with glass on glass fittings and or fittings that don't really have a, um, a screw cap. And in this case, this is a, a kind of a ground fitting or it's, it's smooth and it just sits in there. So what we do, and that's, so this is a volumetric vessel, uh, and this is a coolometric vessel, and, and uh, anything that sits down in here, that would include a, a, a plug um, or a detector electrode or a, a, a different device uh, from an evaporator. Anything that sits against this, you'll see, this is a smooth surface, smooth surface, it's smooth, it's, it just sits in there. So what we do is we take the Carl Fisher grease and all it takes is a small dab, you know, not very much, and when we're applying it, we basically put it on there and we just use our fingers and we just kind of smear it around. And a very thin film is really all that's necessary. And um, when we do this and we put it in to the port, it creates a nice secure fitting. And uh, it's not airtight. We don't have airtight vessels, but it creates a very tight fit. Uh, pre prevents, I think, in some cases a breakage. Uh, it's a, a softer seal. But it also provides, uh, it does a good job of keeping out uh, ambient moisture or what we call drift. And so, yes, Carl Fisher grease, it is important if you're using these kinds of fittings on your vessel. There's a lot of different kinds of vessels out there in the market. Uh, but if you're using a, a, a vessel that's got uh, a ground glass type fitting, uh, I would recommend using Carl Fisher grease for that.